My dear friends, we're all saddened by so much turmoil that has been brought upon this life we live. Yeah, the right thinks the left is immoral and communist. The left thinks the right is immoral and fascist. We have spiraling inflation. Gas and food prices are through the roof. More and more people are becoming homeless. And the entire West looks like it's creatively bankrupt. Can this darkness be lifted? Can we all share joy once again and see eye to eye? That's a good question. How can we see eye to eye when nobody is even trying to find common ground? We have a troubled nation with much horror from these criminals that are ruining lives. We must stop this now. We must bring back our nation's safety. Yeah, in many cities across the U.S., we've seen a rise in violent crime and shoplifting and people who just feel that they can just completely bypass the law. Our police force must act on righteousness and guard our neighborhoods, our businesses, our children, our elderly, our veterans, and our handicapped. We must protect this nation and bring back safety. We're all feeling very unsafe. We're all angry. And yet we have some cities that want less money to go to police. And let's remember why. It starts with the seat of the President of the United States. He has wronged this nation's glory. This isn't a presidential issue. This is an issue of governors and mayors. What is Biden supposed to do? Have the federal government take over? He has taken down our morals, our true gift of the land of the free. How has Biden done that? He must be impeached. For what? What has Biden done that's an impeachable offense? I mean, I don't like Biden. I'd like to see him out of office, but then we'd be left with Kamala. I mean, what are you saying? We cannot wait another second having him dictate our path. What are you referring to? Let us work together, get him out, and make this country what she stands for, greatness. And you think Kamala will give that to us? The land of opportunity, the land of the greatest soil our forefathers fought for. Don't let this President Biden tear down every inch that was sacrificed with blood, sweat, and tears for his dictation of lies. What are you talking about? I urge all to see truths. Truths according to what? The Bible? I urge all to make a difference for our children's future, our future, because my fellow Americans, this land is being broken down. And you think Biden is the cause? But we as a nation of God's truths. Up, oh, well, there it is. Shall build her up once again and bring her to her feet with glory. God bless America. Much love to you. I'm sure he's stating how he really believes, but his message makes no sense. Have a nice day.